Uh, okay. Oh, speaking of other stations, it's kind of a segue. We've had a lot of complaints about pirate radio stations that are interfering with the broadcast of this. I personally have ignored those complaints. Sure, we pass them on to the relevant people when we can be bothered. But it's never affected me, as I have digital radio and I have a strong reception in my area when I drive around in my car. On Friday, uh, Agent Chris and I went to Wolfhamstow to see uh, the Kiss tribute band Dress to Kill. Excellent stuff. On the way back, uh, we were listening to... Well, on the way there... Was it Joe on the way there and Caroline on the way back? It wasn't. On the way there, we were trying to listen to Joe Parkinson's excellent show. She had a guy who had a, 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 a cup of Elvis's water and, and a Philip in the South Norwood. Both were on there. It's a good show. It was ruined a bit by a pirate radio station, Boy CFM. I will not give out the frequency. On the way back, it was impossible to listen to Caroline Faraday. That wasn't because the pirate radio station. It's just impossible to listen to her. But then the pirate radio station got really bad. So Chris and I started... Well, we started dicking around, and we kept phoning them up. Now, this isn't a brilliant recording, okay? This is early days in our war against piracy. But we will beat them. And I got through about five or six times. Uh, and they were quite amused to have a, a white, middle-class, uh, vaguely posh boy going on there and speaking uh, inappropriate language, in terms of, you know, not being very street. Uh, we managed to take one. It's a really bad recording. It's only about 50 seconds, so please stick with it. Uh, but this is just a sign of things to come. You're listening to OCFM on the frequency. It's a little bit naughty. Yeah, cool This is my last call of the evening to the evening again. Just to let everyone know, all the ladies and the gents, I've just made it home. I'm about to go inside. I'm home safe and sound. And I would love to hear a great song by the Beatles when I get in and switch on my hi-fi system. Would that be okay, please, both of you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to do that with cool out here. Hello there. I'm going to dip right in the bottom of the bag right now. Dip you. right in your bag for me, sir. See what magic you can pull out. And let's hope it's got Ringo Starr on the drums. All right, mate. OCFM. Any shout-outs, mate? I'd like to shout-out to Agent Chris, to my mother, Linda, and to any of those hot, foxy women that like this kind of music. All right, mate. Safe you. Chase, good evening. Sweet, mate. The show. So that's how we're going to bring down the pirate radio stations by me phoning them up. We're going to we're working on the technology, uh, and once or twice a, m a week, Chris and I are going to go and sit in my car <laughs> in Walthamstow <laughs> and phone up. I hadn't heard that back. I didn't realise that when they play the phone call out, it's just like a speaker on the other side of the room <laughs> that's playing. Maybe that's what when Clive does the speaker phone. You know, when you, you can hear someone. From, it's like that they're using speaker phone technology for that to work. We'll we'll get them. Those crazy guys. Arthur's in the brain tree.